Ladies and gentlemen, have you heard about the latest in extreme sports? No, it's not synchronized swimming with sharks, it's the world's first jet suit race. Yeah, you heard me right, people zooming around in jet suits like they're auditioning for the real-life Avengers. Now, I know what you're thinking, why didn't Iron Man ever think of organizing a race? Well, it's happening, and it's not in Stark Industries, but in Dubai. So, Gravity Industries, the brainchild of Richard Browning, the real-life Tony Stark without the goatee, is hosting this spectacle. And when I say spectacle, I mean it's not your typical Sunday afternoon bike ride, it's more like a rocket-propelled, adrenaline-fueled circus in the sky. Forget Formula One, we're talking about jet suits tearing through the air like a bunch of turbocharged dragonflies. Now, these jet suits are not your grandma's flying carpet, they're strapped with a single jet turbine on the back and four more on the arms. Imagine Iron Man meet a Cirque du Soleil acrobat on café. The pilot's practically doing gymnastics up there, I bet they'll start handing out gold medals for mid-air somersaults soon. And let me tell you, it's not just about speed, it's about endurance. Holding an iron cross on gymnastics rings? That's basically the pilot's prerequisite to flying one of these bad boys. It's a full-body workout up there, move over, crossfit, we've got jet suits as the new fitness trend. Now, if you've got some spare change lying around, oh, I don't know, just $483,000, you can buy yourself one of these 1,050 horsepower, 60-pound contraptions. It's like buying a sports car, but, you know, one that can make you airborne. Or, if you're not ready to commit to a lifelong relationship with a jet suit, you can drop $3,500 for a day of tethered training. But the real kicker is the upcoming race in Dubai on February 28th. Picture this, jet suits zipping around the Dubai skyline, making a pit stop at the Burj Khalifa for a selfie. An Emirati pilot, Ahmed al Shahi, is gearing up to represent the home team, and I hope they've got a podium that's sturdy enough to handle jet-powered landings. Now, I don't know about you, but I've always wanted to see a race where the finish line is in the air. Will they do a victory barrel roll? Will they throw a checkered flag from 10,000 feet? So many questions. Gravity Industries promises that this jet suit race will be more intense than Formula One. I mean, come on, they've got challenges that require maneuverability, accuracy, and flight speed. It's like the Olympics, but with less synchronized swimming and more synchronized soaring through the clouds. So, folks, mark your calendars for February 28th, and let's show these jet suit pilots some love. And who knows, maybe one day we'll have rush hour traffic in the sky, and you'll look out your window to see Tony Stark casually passing by on his morning commute.